all right hi guys this video is in response to the vaseline lip therapy first impressions product review video i did a year ago um let's just get right into it i could not find the tubes of vaseline lip therapy um for for a year until just recently until just this week in fact and that's why i'm making this video to update you guys um, I know people were asking where I got them from. I was I was buying them from a store called Fred's Dollar Store. You may have had one, you may not have, but that store that chain went out of business, and I hadn't been able to find them until now. So um, in the meantime, I bought these from Target. Um, same brand, same line, Vaseline Lip Therapy. They were, they are, I believe three forty nine. I'll put the price. I'll put the correct price somewhere in the description or around. Um, this one is pink bubbly, so it's supposed to be kind of like a pink champagne, um, kind of a smell. It does have a smell. It is light, and it's, um, it's not, it's not perf extremely perfumey, and it's not flowery. It smells really nice. The Vaseline Lip Therapy works really well for me. Um, it moisturizes my lips, and by it being Vaseline, I don't have to worry about it. Um, giving me any kind of allergic reaction or anything like that. So this is the first one that I got. I've used this one. It's almost gone. Um, the next one, this is actually my favorite, the Rosy Lips. I like it because I don't wear lipstick, but it does give you like a, a light, a, a pink tint to your lips. I have brown skin and it looks really nice on me. I don't know how it would show up on somebody with lighter skin, but um, it's cute. I, I think it'd be good if you don't like lipstick, but it gives you a nice kind of like rosy tint to your lips. And I'll put like a little clip in here um, showing how exactly it looks. Yeah, so this is how the rose um, looks. And I like this one a lot because it has the same, this has the same uh, moisturizing as the other Vaseline's. But it does leave a nice rosy tint to your lips. Okay, moving on. I was able to find these. I was able to find the tubes again, guys. And I know some of you... Or some people were asking where I was getting them from. I was able to find them at Dollar Tree. And like I said, I haven't been able to find them in a year. And I, I searched online. Um, I'm not going to lie. I saw them for sale online. But they were from some websites that I hadn't heard of. And I just wasn't really sure. Um, they looked the same. But again, by me having such a bad allergic reaction last time i'll put i'll put that video and everything in the description talking about why i even started using vaseline and um, products that are safe for lips for sensitive lips yeah i just wasn't sure and i didn't want to risk it so i didn't get those but i was able to get um an original and i like these because it comes in a tube like so let me try to show you can i show you yeah it just comes in a little tube like that let me make sure i put it back right and it's really good now, especially during um, COVID and everything, because with these, I only use these at home. Now, I use them when I'm, I'm going to bed at night. I put some on my lips and when I wake up in the morning or just when I'm around the house. I don't like digging into these with my finger or, you know, getting in, getting it with my finger because I don't want to risk germs and things like that when I'm out in the street. So I was really excited when I saw these um, and because I love the um, rosy lip, of course. I got one of these as well. I gotta try this and see. If you'll notice, it's less tinted. It seems a little less tinted than the one in the tin. The one in the tin has more of a glossy look. So, oh shoot, hold on. Can I do it? There we go. I did it. The one in the tin has more of a glossy look. Um, than the tube, but I'm still going to use it, but I'm going to update, I'll, I'll put it down below how it works if it's still glossy. I also got these, um, from Whole Foods. Um, you may have a Whole Body in your, your, in your neighborhood or whatever, you may just have a Whole Foods. It's in the, the body care section or the body, the, you know, where they sell the body wash and other skin products and things like that. I'm trying to get it to focus. There we go. Yeah, Whole Foods um, Organic Vanilla Honey. So they have these Whole Foods um, lip balms. These are all natural as well. That's why I got these because I didn't want to have to worry about, again, having an allergic reaction. Now, if you're allergic to coconut or um, beeswax, you know, 
um, I always look and even with these I don't want to just tell anybody to blindly get these do it like a patch test on your hand to see if you're gonna have allergic reaction but I didn't um, this one is but it has um, is it beeswax in it yeah it's very waxy it does feel waxy this isn't my favorite one it smells really nice it smells like honey and vanilla um, and it does the job it's fine I don't know if I would get this one again because it's kind of waxy though this one um oh i'm sorry this was a dollar 99 i believe i believe both of these were a dollar 99 or a little bit less i'm not sure i'll put it in the description this is whole foods other brand it's the 365 brand and this one's a medicated lip balm um for dry chap lips and it has yeah it has camphor in it so um I like this one if I'm having like a really bad day, like my lips are really dry or something like that. It really does heal my lips and moisturizes them really good. Um, by it being medicated and having camphor, I think it says like don't use this more than a certain number of times in a day or something like that. If you are feeling like you have a fever or you may be like getting... Like yeah, I'm sorry, my, my finger accidentally hit the camera, cut it off. If you're feeling like you have some kind of a fever or you might be having about to have a cold sore like it's not going to heal a whole cold sore i'm not going to say that but if you know sometimes you get a fever especially this season and your lips get itchy around the edge i always put this on just to be sure um the camphor it really helps like this one really helps to i guess not maybe not get maybe not get fever blisters or cold sores or anything like that um and that's everything i had to show these are the ones i've been getting i definitely want to go back to whole foods and get some more of these maybe in different maybe in some different um I want to say flavors, <laughs> maybe in some different scents. And I feel like I'm going to be collecting these for a while. And of course, I'm very excited about the tubes. So yeah, you can get these from Dollar Tree. You can get the tins from Target. You can get these from Whole Foods. I hope this video has been helpful. Like I said, I'd leave the description. Um, I'll leave the, what am I trying to say? Leave the link to the other one in the description. Yeah. Um, until next time, y'all have a great day. Stay safe. Please forgive my cuticles. They look terrible. <laughs> Don't look. All right. <laughs> Y'all have a good day. Bye.